Hallo mensen van Gamer en Nel, hier is Maak het Tim met deze keer geluid. Oh, get Fraps. Het is het probleem. Nou, heel simpel. Fraps denkt van: Hey Tim, je hebt een G35. Kom, laten we die negeren. Get Fraps. Hier waren we gebleven. Lekker. Oh. Wat? Nou, liever niet. Kijk liever niet naar ze. Smerig hem, jongens. Eens kijken, wat hebben we hier? We kunnen niet om het hoekje. Oh. Oké, okay. ik loop wel weer terug. Hier langs. Is dit geen hitpoint? Oké, okay, dan niet. Voor mij zet het geluid echt heel zacht vandaag. Audio. Voice. 4. Ik vond die sound goed. Zo. Zo. Empty. Somebody already cleaned this place out. Oké. Okay. Must have taken weeks to board up all these windows. Eens kijken. Radioactief bord. Hey. Een nieuwspapermachine. Locked. Nice. Op naar de machine. De verrekijker. Die zoals gewoonlijk weer geld kost in dit land. Fuck! What's up with the boat? It ain't gonna work. Hulls crack beneath the waterline, plus someone stripped out the battery. You can't fix it? What the? What the hell is that? Yeah. <laughs> Than death. Okay. Abandoned, like every other place in this city. What? Uh, no sign of any boats down there. Plenty of docks, no boats. No way that one's salvageable. Ik zie uh, niks. Not a boat to be seen. What the hell? Get down. Get down. Hallo, mysterieus iemand. Why the hell are we hiding? Someone came down from that building at the end of the street. Where'd he go? Saw him run into that newsstand. Could be our bell ringer. How about we go find out? We didn't come here looking for trouble. Yeah, well it seems to have a way of finding us anyways. Look, this could be the guy from the radio. The one who's been messing with us. If he is, we can put an end to it right now. Okay, you head up the middle of the street. I'll go around the side, cover your flank. We'll come up on him quiet, take him by surprise. We just want to talk to this guy. Oh, we're gonna talk. I 
Oké, okay, Kenny, kijk uit. En je kan niet om het gebouw heen lopen. I'm just going to say that. Waar? Waar de fuck is hij heen? Wat Achter je. Oh. Okay. <laughs> You're not from Crawford. You're not the guy on the radio. I'm not a guy at all. Full marks for observation. Mind so. if I get up? Slowly. Kenny, no, it's not our guy! Ah, yippee. No, he's with us! Oké, okay, lekker verwarrend voor iedereen. Hallo, mijn naam is uh, Lee. Who the hell are you people? Everyone just calm down. I'll calm down once she tells me who the fuck she is. Back off, asshole. The name's Molly. Molly? I'm Lee. This is Kenny and Clementine. We're not looking for any trouble. Hi. <laughs> you guys really aren't from Crawford, are you? I don't have to tell oh, you. Nee, 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 nee. Oh, nice. shit. You're gonna go far with that attitude. Shit. What happened to the people here? Ach, yeah. You sure you want to know? Yeah. When everything started going to shit, some people got together and sealed off that whole neighborhood. Folks willing to do anything to stay alive. Stop the dead getting in. I try to avoid them. Why? Let's just say they have a zero tolerance policy for anyone who won't or can't live by their rules. So how'd you know we weren't them? Because there are no children in Crawford. Not anymore. What do you mean, no children? Why not? No children, no elderly, no one with an advanced medical condition. Basically, no one who might be a burden on the community. Crawford's all about the survival of the fittest. That's how they survived, while the rest of the world went to shit around them. Jesus Christ. Well, just the opposite when you think about it. Yeah. That's not how our group does things. You're not saying they actually... Uh, I, mean, I mean, kids? No. The children, they just forced to leave, along with their parents. Left them to fend for themselves out here in the world. Why? Like I said, zero tolerance. Crawford got rid of anyone that couldn't pitch in, pull their own weight. The way they looked at it, those people were just a lot of useless mouths to feed. A drain on their precious resources. Okay. Yeah. So okay, though. Okay. Everyone in Savannah knew. What was going on inside Crawford got passed around like a ghost story. Except this one was true. Yeah. Clem, what the hell are you doing here? How'd you get out of the house? Well, Mead started getting really sick. Krista and Ben had to take him upstairs. I didn't just want to sit around there. I wanted to come help. I told you we didn't need any help. Ach ja. Uh. Do you know who's been ringing those bells all over town? Yeah, that would be me. I knew it. 
Lee, I knew she was the one who'd been following us. Fucking with us. Get that finger out of my face, Grandpa, before I jam it straight up your ass. I haven't been following you. I don't even know who the hell you people are. Calm down, Kenny. The voice on the radio was a guy, remember? Yeah, well, whoever you are, ringing those bells this morning nearly got us all killed. Raise the dead all around us. That's the idea, genius. It's how I get around. I ring a bell in one neighborhood to attract the local geeks towards it. Buys me some time to scavenge the areas they cleared out. Geeks? Is that what you call them? Yeah, you know, like at the carnival? They'll eat anything, alive or dead. <laughs> That's pretty <laughs> smart, the bells. Doesn't take much to outsmart the dead. Bunch of dumbasses. You just gotta move fast. Get in and out before they start to wander back again. Look, I'm gonna ask you people again. You're not from Crawford, so who the hell are you? What are you doing here? Came down here looking for a boat. Hoping to get our people out of here and find someplace safe. Yeah, good luck with that. Anyone with a boat took it out of here as soon as people started eating each other. Any that got left behind, Crawford stripped them for parts. Cars, too. Huh. There's gotta be something. If there was, do you think I'd still be here? I've been over every inch of this city. This whole place is picked clean. God damn it! Fuck! Hey, moron. You wanna keep your voice down? Shit. Since you're not getting on any boat, I'd advise you folks to go back to where you came from before... Great. Just great. Okay, like her. Zombies. Isn't that the the way we came? Fuck. Gunshot must have brought him back. Isn't there another way back to the house? Mom, is there a? Sir. Hey, you just gonna leave us here? Sorry, I must have missed that part of our conversation where you became my problem. Don't leave us here, please. Come on, make it fast. Oh, fuck me. Come on, come on, hurry. Lee, come on. Come on, man. One good jump. Dit alweer, hè? Come on, Lee, get your ass out of there. Ah, can't get it open. Here, use that to pry it open. Sneller. Weer a spam and I had that. Mooi. Op tijd. Uh, eens kijken. Maar jongens, ik had vandaag niet heel te veel tijd. Dit is even een korte special tussendoor, omdat ik vorige keer dus geen voice had, kut fraps. Ja, fraps. Ik heb een goede g 35 Kom, laten we die negeren. Kut fraps. Um, eens kijken. Ik zie jullie uh, weer op Walking Dead maandag. Dit was het voor vandaag. Ik had echt niet meer tijd vandaag om te recorden. Ik moet straks echt gaan. Ik ben al te laat. Dus, ik zeg bedankt voor het kijken. Vergeet geen groen duimpje achter te laten voor deze korte, maar toch leuke episode van Walking Dead. We zijn nu in het riool. Vergeet dat niet. En uh, ik zeg bedankt voor het kijken. Vergeet geen groen duimpje te laten. En uh, doei!